then click on add wait for a few seconds and as you can see my website is created successfully now scroll down yo Hatem is here from geekblocking.com and I'll show you today how to transfer your domain name from any provider to Hostinger. Before we begin, subscribe with notifications on and follow me on my Instagram account at geek.blogging. Today's video is sponsored by Hostinger. So first, log into your Hostinger account. I assume by watching this video that, that you already have bought your Hostinger plan. If not, go down below and use my link in the description. And use my coupon code GeekBlogin to get a discount of percent off. Now go right here in this bar at the top and click on Hosting. So now here are all my linked domain. If you have a single shared plan and you already have a website, make sure to upgrade to the next level to get the unlimited website feature. Here in this video, we got two websites for this tutorial. One in GoDaddy and the other one is registered in Namecheap. The one in GoDaddy, uh, which is this one, is already linked, but I'm, I'm going to relink it. So now click first on Add Website and let's start with the Namecheap domain. Here, enter the domain name you want to transfer and type the password of your account here. Then click on add. Wait for a few seconds. And as you can see, my website is created successfully. Now scroll down. It will appear here on the list of the websites and click on manage. Here, uh, you will get this error message about pointing in problem. It's easy, don't panic. <laughs> I'm here to show you. So uh, go to your name chip uh, account, log in to get into, into this dashboard. You'll have here all your registered domains. Just for a quick fact, I get this domain right here for free. If you want to get yours too, watch my previous video on how to do so by clicking the pop up popping up right now. So click on manage on the domain you, you wish to update, scroll down and next to name servers, choose custom DNS. Now we will go back to hosting and copy past these values right here. Then click on this check mark right here. For GoDaddy, I've already added my website. So what I'm going to do is sign in first uh, using your account, then go to uh, on, the, on this dashboard, all your domains will appear right here. Click on manage or just directly click on DNS for the domain you wish to connect. Scroll down right here and click on change. Then choose enter my own name servers and go back and select your website. It is. So. It might not be activated uh, right away. You need to verify uh, the, this action by uh, confirmation mail. Note, once uh, you have made changes to your DNS at the registrar, there will be 24 to 84 hours of DNS propagation time during which your website and email may not be available and for this error message to disappear. However, if you want to skip all this trouble, you can simply transfer your domain using their uh, feature of transferring domain. You can go to this link uh, that you will find in the description box, enter here your domain name and, and you will pay uh, about uh, 15 to 16 dollars in order to do so. However, using uh, my link down below in the description and with my discount code GeekBlogging you will get 10% off. Then after proceeding with the purchase, you will enter the EPP code, uh, which you will ask your uh, provider uh, to give it to you. Then you confirm, confirm your transfer. And it will usually take uh, no longer than five days. This is it guys. I want to thank again the sponsor of this video, Hostinger. So if you want to support us, 
please consider using our affiliate link on the description box in order to support us. All the links used during this video will be in the description box. Two, click the like button, subscribe with notifications on, and share this video with your friends. Peace out.